guys, it's Rebecca. Um, I, sorry, I'm kind of shaky and all over the place. I'm currently sitting at the hospital, um, waiting for a friend to get out of surgery. Um, so I thought I would make a video because I apparently lost like, a tr track of time. I thought it had only been about like a week since I, um, posted a video and I looked today and it has been three weeks. So I wanted to, um, post and get something up right away. So I'm super sorry that, um, it has been so long. I don't like leaving it that long, but it has been a crazy lead up to Christmas. Um, as I'm sure you all can relate, um, between work and church and life and Christmas prep and everything else, um, it's just been super busy. So, um, please forgive that my camera is super shaky right now. I am trying to hold it, hold it up. So anyways, um, <clears throat> so let's see what's new and exciting. Um, well, let me first start by saying Merry Christmas to all of you. Um, I know today is Boxing Day, but I know people are still celebrating, so Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I hope that, um, your holiday season has gone well and that you're all prepared for your, um, New Year's and getting, um, geared up for an amazing 2018. Um, what's new is it's Boxing Day, and for the first time ever, I have actually lost weight at Christmas time, so that's pretty cool. Um, so let's run through the stats. So, um, I am 33, I didn't think about that, I'm 33, I had surgery on October 24th, 2017, um, so I had bariatric surgery, I had that in Toronto, um, at the Michael Guerin Center, um, I had two surgeons, and my starting weight before OptiFast was 384 pounds, um, the day of surgery I was about 350 pounds, and then, um, my current weight as of today is 306 pounds. So that brings my total weight loss to 78 pounds. So I have to say I'm pretty impressed that since October 3rd when I started um, bear, like the sorry the OptiFast that I'm down 78 pounds. That's a lot of weight. That's almost 80 pounds in not even three months. So um, I knew that it would come off fast. I didn't think it would come off this fast, but I'm feeling pretty good. There's lots of positive things. Um, some negative things that I've run into is I have chronic back pain. Um, that's not so much on the fun. Um, so I have two SI joint issues. Um, one, like on the left and the right side. And so I won't be able to, so I'm just going to change positions and hope that that my arm lifts. Okay. Um, one on the right, like my right SI and my left SI are both, um, they both cause a lot of pain, so um, I can't return to the job that I've been doing, which kind of sucks. And um, so I'm just trying to figure out what my next my next path is going to be while I figure that out. So you know, um, uh, okay. Can anybody see that? I actually have like dimples. <sighs> can my dimples never show up before? Anyways, um, <clears throat> sorry. <laughs> um, that was random. Um. So, yeah, so I'm looking at doing some child care, some stuff like that. We'll see what happens. Um, outside of that, I've been on the go a lot. I've had a lot of late nights, a lot of early mornings. Um, was doing some stuff with my church because um, we always do a big um, Christmas event every year. And then um, teaching Sunday school yesterday was busy with um, family dinners and, <clears throat> excuse me, get-togethers. Um, so I officially had my first turkey dinner. Um yesterday and it went well it was you know making sure to eat slow um I had a very like very small portions I allowed myself a little bit of everything and yeah it went really well um today I am at the hospital for a friend she um had surgery she had gastric bypass surgery about um two years ago in October and ever since she's had a lot of complications and so um she wound up with um, some pretty serious complications and was in the ICU last week and then they were able to move her to a surgical floor for a day or two while we waited for her to get this surgery because um, we were just waiting for like the surgeons to be able to do it. They actually had to bring a surgeon in from another city um, because our surgeons hadn't dealt with a case like this yet. So 
our bariatric um, surgery team is still very new here, um, and so she is having someone brought in. And so she is in surgery, and for all that they need to do, they said it was going to be three to five hours, and she's probably been in surgery for maybe an hour, hour and a half. So um, we've still got a little bit of time to go, um, but we're just praying that everything will go well. And I really believe that this will mean that in the end, um, she'll be a much healthier person. She's already lost, like, a ton of weight. The weight loss part was not the problem. Um, it was that she was getting to the point where she couldn't eat anything and um, constantly in pain. So I think that this is going to make a huge, significant difference in in her life. So, um, so yeah, so I'm hanging out at the hospital today waiting to hear how this goes. Um, I'm her contact person today, so um, I thought, why not make a video? Um, outside of that, um, I think we might go see Star Wars because Justin and I haven't seen it yet. Um, and he doesn't have to go back to work tomorrow, so I'm super excited about that. So I think we might go see Star Wars tonight, um, as a little date night, um, and if not that, Doctor Who Christmas special will be what we watch, because we haven't seen it yet. So, um, yes, we are total geeks and nerds at my house, which I love. Um, I never considered myself a geek or a nerd, um, until I got married and have been indoctrinated, but I love it. I'm not complaining, so, um... Yeah, that's pretty much the rundown of what's happening in my world. Um, things are pretty good overall. Um, I do have to talk to my nurse practitioner. I think that um, I may have a stricture. I don't know if it's just that I'm eating too fast or not eating the right things, but I'm having a, a hard time with some foods and um, pain and nausea and stuff like that. So I'm going to talk to them and see what they say. Um, so, yeah. Alright guys, I hope you're having a great day. I hope you've had a great Christmas. I hope things are going well for you. And um, I will be back soon to make another video. Alright guys, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Bye.